Here we have a World War I Switzerland helmet. Switzerland, I believe, was with the Germans during World War I, if you can tell by the style of the helmet. This helmet I bought for about $100 at an antique mall, believing the tag said World War II Japanese helmet, which of course I did not believe. So I bought it, I took it home, and I did some research, and it was indeed World War I. Uh, it's really, this is all metal, the strap, I'm guessing this is, this feels like a leather. The only thing new are these bolts, these bolts. The bolts have been redone, you can tell because they're shinier and stuff. The, the helmet comes off, or the strap comes off. Like so. Not much of a comfort system. I'm guessing there were uh, some rope intertwined in these loopholes. And this feels like a, this stuff along the edge here feels like a rope or something. This is all worn leather here. This comes out a bit like this. And there are some kind of pads here. And they're very dirty. Um, there is a number issued in the back. I don't know if you can read it. It's kind of faded, but it says down there right at the bottom. It says A886, I think it's a 189. And underneath it is a scratched name. It's in red, so I don't know how well you can see it. But it says... Vangelina, which I'm guessing maybe a girlfriend, wife, something, but the inside is just metal. It's all very worn. There are scratches on it and stuff. And so I'm pretty sure this is World War One Swiss. If you don't think it looks whatever you think it is, I don't know. I think it's World War One Swiss. But that's about it.